Now at noon, taking a stand, hundreds of high school students walk out of class this morning to support a teacher who was placed on administrative leave. The teacher had voiced his concerns over security at Cherry Hill High School East. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Jim Donovan. And I'm Rahel Solomon. I would assume reporter Cleve Bryan is live at the school now in Camden County, where some parents came out to support the protest. Cleve, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Well, the protest uh, has now at least moved inside. We're not sure if they all went back to class, but they've at least gone back into the building. And as you mentioned, we did speak with some parents who support the students' right to protest. They're not happy about the situation with this teacher being put on administrative leave, but we haven't gotten any indication that the situation is over. Hundreds of students at Cherry Hill East High School walked out of class in solidarity Tuesday morning, marching along a nearby street and around the school track. The protest is to support history teacher Tim Locke, who is on administrative leave. According to students and parents, Locke forcefully spoke out last week about the need for Cherry Hill Leafs to beef up security after the mass school shooting in Parkland, Florida. One of the students who heard Locke's warning that a shooting was likely at the school allegedly reported him to administration leading to his administrative leave. Some parents we met came out to support the student protest. One of the girls from East posted a very well written post, a public post on Facebook that I thought was amazing last night and I knew they were marching Then I saw kind of the helicopter coverage and thought this is good for them. So Rachel Kirkham and her friend bought coffee and several boxes of donuts and brought them over. What do you think about these kids taking the stand? <laughs> I think it's amazing. I, I, I absolutely so think it's amazing. Yeah. It makes me think of Whitney Houston's like, we believe children are our future. I know that sounds really cheesy, but this whole movement, I think it's incredible. Now we have a request to talk to the superintendent, but we haven't heard whether or not uh, that will happen. They say right now the district does not comment on any personnel matters. However, parents and students say they plan to attend a school board meeting tonight. Live in Cherry Hill, I'm Cleve Bryan, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Cleve, thank you.